Hi Sagittarius, this is Wendy. Welcome to my channel, Wendy's Tarot. In this video, we're going to go ahead and ask the cards, why did your person ghost you? Why did your person ghost you? Okay, so we're going to find out why they ghosted you, what are their current feelings for you right now, and will they be returning back to you? All right, let's go ahead and get started. Just as a reminder, this is a general reading. It might not resonate with everyone, but if it resonates with you, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I'd really appreciate it. All right, let's get let's get started. Spirit, please show me why did this person go Sagittarius? Whoever it is that Sagittarius was connecting to in love and whoever it is that Sagittarius is thinking about right now, why did this person go Sagittarius? Please show me. Okay, first card we have is the Three of Pentacles in reverse. Some of you might have been dealing with an Earth sign, Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus. We have the Knight of Pentacles in reverse. The Chariot in reverse could be a Cancer. The King of Swords upright could be a Gemini, Aquarius, or Libra. We have Justice in reverse, Emphasis on, on Libra, and the Page of Cups upright. Pisces or Scorpio. All right, um, so I do feel um, Sagittarius like this person, either they had commitment issues or they had trust issues here. Um, both pentacle, both cards that are pentacles are in reverse and pentacles represent commitment and um, taking responsibility for something. Um, so I feel like this person didn't want to carry any responsibilities. They didn't want to be involved in a commitment. Um, I feel like they were almost, it feels a little bit lazy. Someone who's a little bit lazy here. However, the King of Swords is here. Um, so this can be someone who's very um, smart, very intelligent, or very tactful. Um, this is someone who always has a strategy or always has some kind of plan going on. Um, they're very attentive to the details. And the King of Swords can be someone who um, only likes to involve themselves in in things that are convenient to them if it's malefic right because the justice is in reverse here so this person might have been trying to be my my this person might be sneaky with the justice card in reverse they're not afraid to do things that are outside um You know, outside of what is moral or what what one would consider is moral or even legal. Page of Cups is here. Um, this does represent that this person did feel um, an energy of attraction to you. Um, they did have feelings for you, although it is a page, you know, pages are small small energy almost like a crush i feel like this person had a had a crush on you but they were being too sneaky here too um possessive or controlling and i'm guessing that they didn't really get their way with you um, if this person ghosted you, I'm guessing it's because, you know, um, you didn't you didn't really conform to what they were expecting or the, or or what they were trying to achieve 
with you. All right, let's get a little bit of more clarification here. I want to know about the King of Swords spirit. Please clarify the King of Swords here. We have the Nine of Pentacles in reverse. Codependency, what else? And the Two of Pentacles upright. Okay, so they were they were indecisive here in regards to whether to be in a relationship with you or not. Um, and if it's being clarified, if it's clarifying the King of Swords, then it means that this person didn't feel like it was in their best interest um, it wasn't convenient for them it wasn't going to support them or help them in any way to to be in a relationship with you it didn't make sense logically tell me about the justice in reverse spirit we have the ten of wands okay so this person felt like there was something unfair here between you and and them in this relationship they felt like this relationship was a heavy burden for them what is this page of cups spirit we have the high priestess okay so this is someone who's being silent so this person was keeping their feelings for you a secret here what else and the six of pentacles They didn't feel like it was, um, like the relationship was equal. They felt like it was one-sided. Or they felt like their feelings for you were, were not mutual. They felt like it was unrequited love. Tell me about the Three of Pentacles in Reverse Spirit. We have the Empress here. Yeah, so definitely the Empress with the Three of Pentacles can be someone who doesn't really want to compromise, you know. So this person, I feel like, didn't really want to compromise with you or they felt like you didn't want to compromise with them. It could also be that. Keep in mind, roles can be turned around, um, switched around. Okay, what else? We have the Page of Wands. There was a lack of... Um, effective communication between you two you two were not communicating well with each other you weren't on the same page tell me about the knight of pentacles in reverse we have the ace of cups in reverse so no one was taking advantage of this opportunity to have a new beginning in love tell me about the chariot in reverse we have the Seven of Wands. Okay, someone was creating resistance here. Someone was being um, Yeah, someone was being kind of aggressive here with the Seven of Wands. What else? And the lovers in reverse. Yeah, so someone here was kind of fighting the other person or resisting the other person, blocking them. There's a lot of friction here. I feel like you two just were not were not thinking the same way. So let me see your side of things, Sagittarius Spirit. Show me um, what were Sagittarius's feelings for this person. How was Sagittarius responding to this person or interacting with this person?
We have the Four of Swords, Wheel of Fortune in reverse. Sorry for the noise, there's some noise outside. The Death card, Three of Pentacles, Nine of Swords, Emperor. I can see you were definitely feeling upset with the Four of Swords in reverse. Um, there was a continuous cycle here with the Wheel of Fortune. The Death card can mean that you two were on and off, on and off. The Three of Pentacles, I definitely feel like you wanted to work together with this person. Um, your intentions were to get on the same page with this person. Um, you were trying to do the right thing with the Emperor. You were trying to be fair. And you were putting in the effort. But I feel like this person wasn't putting in the effort. They were being resistant to you. They were, um, they were blocking you or they were being aggressive towards you. So what did this person want with Sagittarius Spirit? What is it that they were looking for here? What did this person want um, from Sagittarius? We have the King of Wands in reverse, the Death card, Seven of Swords, Five of Cups, Knight of Swords in reverse. They wanted you to return back to them. They had certain they had certain expectations, um, but uh, you came up as the Emperor, so. You're not so easily manipulated, and I feel like this person is um, was trying to manipulate you. Um, they might. It's possible that they were giving you some sort of sad story um, with the Five of Cups, but I don't feel like you bought it. You didn't buy the sad story. I felt like this person just was very inconsistent in your life. They they go back and forth, back and forth, and they're being very sneaky here with the Seven of Swords. Um, trying to outsmart you in some way but I don't feel like you you fell for it and I feel like that's why they left or they ghosted you because it's like you weren't cooperating with them but a relationship should be about cooperating with each other you know um, however I don't feel like this person saw it that way I think this is someone a little bit manipulative or bossy Will they be returning back to Sagittarius Spirit? Will they be returning back to Sagittarius? We have here the Magician, the Hermit in reverse. Yeah, they will. Seven of Swords in reverse. Seven of Cups in reverse, Three of Swords in reverse. Yeah, I definitely see them returning back to you. Um, they're definitely infatuated with you, I want to say, with the Seven of Cups here and the Page of Cups. Um, there's a little bit, there's a low-key obsession going on with this person towards you, okay? All right, Sagittarius, I hope this was helpful. Please give me a thumbs up if it resonated. And thank you for watching. Bye, Sagittarius. Take care.